when the first team players come down to get involved with Powerchair football, I'm excited to meet them because obviously they're, they're my heroes that actually play every week and I watch them. And sometimes I try to tell them how to play, but it doesn't really work. I think we're very, very fortunate with this football club. I think as a playing staff, they are really great people. Um, and whenever we get them to our events, they are they're, they're superb. But Chris just stands out um, as one of those who, you know, every time he turns up, he gives it 100% for us. He never lets us down. Um, and he's, you know, genuinely been the, the best player that we've had from a community uh, aspect over the last, you know, certainly the last 10 years that he's been here at the club. Chris, Chris is just, just really grounded, really genuine guy, just um, will turn his hand at anything. Whenever he turns up for anything, he's got a genuine interest. He connects with, you know, the guys in the community, our staff, remembers people's names. Um, you know, and he, he, he has, over the years, he's come to a number of events and he spoke really, really well. He's, He's an intelligent guy, he, he gets it, he understands it, and he's able to portray it. And having someone to do that at that level um, just really is the icing on the cake for us as a foundation. And he, he's been a, a brilliant ambassador for, for the club over many, many years. But I just think that when, when the players um, can bring themselves into um, and work alongside, say, the likes of the foundation. Just puts a smile on people's faces. Like Chris Brunt, you know, he's known for a sweet foot, a lovely cross, somebody jumps on the end of it, and thank you very much, that's three points. But these kids are, are, are realised, and when they can come within a certain distance or actually touch or speak to, you know, Chris or any of the lads, it gives them kids, it gives everybody a little bit of a buzz. So it's going to help all the way around. And, and I just hope that the way that the, the first team players have been sort of um, bringing themselves back into what I call the real world, they'll never realise how much those players can offer to people. Um, and it's fantastic for you know one or two of them. As I say, or even Tiny Peerless to be there what a difference it makes to people because they can get close to them.